Crystal here. Welcome back to Rosewolf. Today is the 8th of July 2017. How are you guys doing today? Welcome back. Uh, so yay, finally it is sunny when I'm actually able to film during the day. It was just raining non-stop last week, I swear. Um, and for the last few weeks actually. Ooh, hi dragonfly. You just chill. Okay, bye. Never mind. Um, anyway, let's check our mail. To Midnight's Crystal, when do you what do you wish for when you look up at the night sky? I wish for someone special to be there watching the stars with me. Who is the special someone? I wonder. Obviously, it's Bob. Everyone, Bob is everyone's special someone. Come on, get your act together, O'Hare. Clearly, um, <laughs> dear Crystal, can you get your message across using only one line? If you practice as I have, it can become very easy. Observe. I hope you're doing well. Yours, Robin. I could like feel the sass coming off that letter. I love it. <laughs> um, from Bob, I guess I'll toss that one as well. Anyways, um, I have done a little bit of playing between episodes. I was just continuing on with um, tidying up the town. Are you back again? <laughs> creepy, uh, creepy dragonfly. Um, just in terms of cleaning up flowers. Oh, hi, bud. Arranging stuff. I want to refresh my mind a little. So I'm thinking about moving- Hmm... Uh, suddenly I'm thinking of all the amiibo cards I have and if I have any good jock villagers. I don't know if I do. Oh no, I don't want to say- no. Mm. You know what? I'm not gonna say- I'm not gonna say yes. Yeah, don't go. Oh, come on, you're making it really hard for me to leave. Okay, I give up. I can't move now. I'll see you around. Yeah, you darn straight, you'll see me around. Gosh darn it, man. I thought we were bros. <laughs> no, um, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna let a villager move out unless they ask, like, maybe during stream or something, just because it gives you guys the chance to respond. Because, like, obviously I'm sitting in my room by myself talking to myself, essentially, but I am referring to you guys when I speak, so, like, I don't know what you guys really want. That's interesting. Maybe I should line the entire hill here. Or cliff? Cliff, that's the right word. Um, with Jacob's Lives, I don't think I could breed enough. Or not breed, spawn, I guess, enough, but that'd be an interesting idea. Anyways, um, so yeah, today we're going to be doing some basic just town maintenance type stuff. I want to do some diving after because we have not done that in a little while. Oh gosh, it started. They are so noisy. Have I caught you already? I don't think I have. I don't even know. Also, because it's not like, you know, what, whatever. Oh gosh darn it, <laughs> whatever time it usually is when I record, which is like maybe 7 or 8 in the evening. Um, we don't have to worry about the tarantula, I don't have to keep my volume blasted high in case it comes over. Or the scorpion, I guess, as well. Which is good. So yeah, I've just, like, you'll, you'll notice a lot more flowers just kind of organized, I guess. That's kind of what I did yesterday, just when I was kind of looking for the um, tarantula and I didn't find one, so it's fine. <laughs> There's one fossil. I didn't um, dig up any fossils yesterday. I was literally just signing on pretty much to either catch the tarantula or uh, organize flowers. So I pretty much know where a good number of them are, I feel like. <laughs> so that's always good. Do I already have this? Yeah, I didn't. Awesome. Okay. Um, but anyway, I hope you guys are excited for later on today. If you guys aren't aware, for the last... I guess it's been three years? Uh, every year on July 8th I have done a town tour of my other town, Rosewood, which some of you who are newer may not even be aware of. Um, essentially Rose Wolf, the town that we're in now, is kind of like my parody town. Um, which has become my main town. Anyway, also this, I accidentally created a Pokeball yesterday without realizing it. I'm pretty proud of it. <laughs> I may expand on that actually. Um, but, uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. It will be out later on this afternoon. I think after this video, um, I want to film it around 12 so all of my villagers are awake because I do have uh, some late waker uppers, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, that should be fun. And then the other thing to look forward to is the tarantula and scorpion 
guide coming out soon. I just need to get the footage of uh, catching the tarantula and then we'll be all good. I have pretty much everything else done for that video actually. <laughs> Oh man, we're we're doing good our encyclopedia today. I am happy. <laughs> Cuz uh I've been really bad about that and you guys know that. Um let's go say hi to Peggy. Cuz like I don't feel like we talked to her enough. I feel like she's the one villager other than Pajmina who we don't see very often. I forgot what your house looked like. Your shirt actually does like it matches your furniture. I like it. I know it's O'Hare's, but <laughs> Uh, what's the latest? Hey, word is your way into catching fish, Crystal. I hope that's true. Because I heard that owning a crawfish... Uh, crawfish is caught in the pond, right? I'll try. I've never heard of them wanting something... Actually, no, I guess frogs are from ponds, and I know villagers have asked for frogs before. Hopefully that's from a pond and I'm not just making that up. We'll have to go, uh, check it out. Um, so... Let's see here. We have two ponds in this town, one in our park and one, as always, next to retail. Also, Shep, hi buddy, I'll talk to you in a second. Did you change shirts? Is that- is that Poppy's shirt? You don't even know Poppy, what are you do- Shep! Gosh darn it, Poppy. Continually haunting Rosewood. Rose Wolf. Wrong town. Are you a crawfish? Please be a crawfish. I got too excited, sorry. Let's try at the other pond. <laughs> oh, hi, buddy. Okay, uh, no. Man, I just ruined everything, as per usual. Don't mind me. Wade, how's it going? <laughs> On nice days, I like to have picnics outside. Eat some lunch, take a nap. I mean, that's pretty much what I do at home anyway, but doing it outside makes it feel special. You are just the sweetest thing, I swear. Other than Bob. <laughs> Nothing can really compare to Bob. Okay, so new plan of action. For this episode, we're going to continually check both ponds until we catch a crawfish, because I'm like 90% sure that's where you catch them. Now, where did my pupper go? Shep? Shep, come here, boy. Come here. Where is he? Shep, gosh darn it. Just teleporting on me. <laughs> oh, ooh, hi. There you are. So, Crystal, I heard you may have in your possession a... No. No, I just caught that. No. I know that they're not that rare, but no. Nope. No, but I was told that is Melba said you did. Sorry for the mistake. I haven't even seen Melba today. How would she know? Is she creeping on me too? Okay, officially confirmed. Rose Wolf is full of creepers. All of my villagers just creep on each other and on me. Uh, da -da -da. Nothing here. Perfect. I love this. This is really growing on me. I think it looks gorgeous, especially now that it's in full bloom. I think I'm just excited to see bushes, like, actually having flowers and stuff on them. Because <laughs> usually, they like, for most of the year, at least the ones I seem to choose, don't. So. Alright, nothing on the bulletin board today. Mm, nothing over here. Still not exactly sure if I should do anything with that area, or if I should just leave it as just, like, a side area just full of trees. I don't know. We'll see. I may actually- you know what? I have plenty of space over there. What I could do is try and do what I was, I guess, trying to do with the uh, town plaza, where I had one of every single type of tree next to each other. Do I already have that one, or is that the same one I caught earlier? Um, because with the- uh, with the plaza, I got, um, I guess foiled. My plans were foiled by a rock. Which, like, you know, is like the fifth time that's happened. Okay, that's the one that Shep just wanted. <laughs> oh, now I feel like it's such a mean person. Um, 
But like seriously, the rocks in this town are really annoying. They're like in the worst places, I swear. There's the one right here that has fooled me like two times putting down paths and, and bushes and stuff. I hear a balloon. I see a balloon, okay. Do I have my slingshot on me? I do. Yay. <laughs> Couldn't try getting more of those because I've been putting those off a bit. Balloon dresser, all right, so still nothing, I guess, worth noting. Also, thank you guys very much for your suggestions on, uh, I guess, the flower placement around uh, Rose Whoop. I, I think oh, somebody suggested, I think it was like pink tulips and yellow something. I don't remember if it was also tulips around the campsite, and I think that's going to look gorgeous, so I'll probably end up doing that. Um, and also, this is not the flowers, or rather, these are not the flowers that are going to stay around uh, Wade's house. It's just, it's kind of temporary right now. I might leave them up this row right here and then just have his flowers, you know, obviously surrounding his house. But I like this combination here, so that's why I haven't really uh, moved it or, or gotten rid of it. Do I have that one? That's gonna be the story of this of this uh, let's play. Do I have that? <laughs> Cause like, oh, I'm so bad at remembering what I've already caught. Or or even, uh, I actually have a solemn painting in my pockets because I think Gaston sold it to me, um, as you know villagers sometimes do. And like you know, it could be real, but I might already have it, so it wouldn't even matter. <laughs> Do I already have this one? Apparently I do, okay. Fair enough. Uh, okay. Let's take this white lily back over to where the white lilies and red tulips are. I'm kind of in a flower, I guess, organization, organizational mood. Does that make sense? I think it does. So don't mind me. <laughs> uh, no, no, I want my shovel, please. Please? There we go. Thank you. Okay, so Wade, you're chilling up there. I need to finish this area too. Town tree is doing wonderfully. I love it. We have some vines growing up the bottom, which is really cute. It's doing really good. We're doing very good, actually. <laughs> Considering how, I guess, limited of a time frame I have to play this game every day. Um, let's go see who our camper is. Uh, I think you're Rudy, right? You're pretty cute. Are you another lazy, though? I have a feeling he's another lazy, and we already have two. And I- do we have ten villagers? We have ten villagers, right? I think. Suddenly I'm just counting them in my head. Uh, let's take a look at the map here. Three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, two. Okay, yeah. So we definitely do have maximum, unfortunately. I wish that we could... Um, I only found two fossils again. That's upsetting. Uh, I wish that uh, someone could come over and like take the villager from my campsite, but unfortunately that isn't a thing. I thought it was for the longest time, but I have since been most definitely proven wrong. <laughs> I wish though, it'd be really nice to just, like, you know, have a really cool villager like Bob um, and for you guys to have the chance to come over and uh, have him in your town, because I know a lot of you people since watching my stuff has suddenly developed a very strange interest in Bob, same as me, so <laughs> I know a lot of people want him. But then again, from my understanding, a lot of people, like a lot of other YouTubers, really like Bob also, so maybe it's just like an Animal Crossing YouTuber slash Twitch streamer type thing. I don't know. It just seems to be all of us to have this strange thing for him. Okay, yeah, I know that you already have them, but I'm gonna donate some stuff that you don't have. Uh, yeah. And also, maybe the painting? 
No, he already had it. Oh well. Oh wait, no, that's two of the same one. <laughs> oh well, it was worth a try. I know that we've actually done a lot of work on the, I guess, art museum, so I'm not really that bothered, but... Oh well. <laughs> Okay, so just another FYI, you guys, there will be a stream later on today. Um, it will be at 7 p.m. EST. It's just, I don't even know. It's its a much easier time for me, I guess, is the best way to describe it. It's later on in the day. I don't feel like I'm splitting my day in half, essentially. Um, it gives me plenty of time to film and do, like, you know, other stuff. Poppy! Poppy, you creeping? Dude. <gasps> Hi, buddy. You're wearing Poppy's shirt. I just realized. Gaston, <laughs> <laughs> you need to wear a cute, like, skull shirt or something. That would suit you. <laughs> now, what should I get? Oh, that's it? Okay. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna steal this. Not steal this. I mean, I'm gonna buy it, but I'm gonna, you know, snag it. Definitely not stealing, you guys. Definitely not. Never. <laughs> um... No. Uh, and I don't think I want any of that stuff. So somebody uh, in the comment section was suggesting that they think that you have to actually speak to Leaf in order to get the gold axe. Um, from my memory at least, you just purchase like, you know, the 50th sapling and then he'll say, oh, like, you know, this purchase comes with a happy bonus or something, just like he did for, um, was it the silver watering can that he gave us? I can't even remember. <laughs> Yes, please. But I'll try. I'm happiest when I'm just walking around town and happen upon a flower starting to bloom. Stunning. Well, then you must love our town because there's flowers everywhere. <laughs> okay, perfect. Not really in the mood for clothes shopping, so let's go sell off everything that we don't need and then we're gonna change into our diving suit and see if we can't catch anything new. Also, we haven't spoken to Bob yet today. I, I, for some reason I assumed that we had seen him though, but I think it's because I was playing in my other town earlier, which, you know, obviously also has a Bob. He's not his house. He might be in the museum. Oh well. Oh, hi. You gonna suggest the public works project, buddy? At least I was think who- Ooh, comfy sweater. Don't mind if I do. I mean, it's really hot right now, but maybe later on. What's it look like? Is this cute? Do I want this? I am... That's a bound. <laughs> Props to you guys if you recognize who I'm talking about. Um, okay, so I want to keep the CD player, but everything else I'm going to just sell. Yeah. I, uh, I'm not... Actually, you know what? The reason why I'm actually going to be selling the pine tree as well <laughs> is because I actually have, like, a storage thing full of them. Uh, from when I was buying them originally, I wasn't selling them, so... Also, that tricycle is super cute, and I kind of want to put it in Bob's room. So I might actually just buy that and just send it to him in a letter. Hopefully he'll take it, because <laughs> sometimes they just don't. What am I paying the disposal fee for? Did I select something I shouldn't have selected? Is the disposal fee for the painting, or is it for the tree? It must be for the tree? No, I'm confused. I just didn't want to, like, you know, sell a tool or something. Because I don't think they give you a warning if you do. Okay. I'm not exactly sure what that would... It must have been... I'm, I'm pretty sure it was the tree. I'm pretty sure that if a painting is considered fake, which we didn't even determine if that one was real or fake. Um, it just sells for much less, I think? If I'm remembering correctly. Anyway, let's go get changed. Let's go do some diving. 
my absolute favorite thing to do. No, I'm joking. Really, though, we do need to uh, work on our uh, diving encyclopedia. And also work on our house. This place is kind of a mess. Um, let me just shove tools and stuff in here. We're gonna keep our shoes on, because I don't know about you guys, but when I go, like, swimming in a lake, I hate touching the bottom and feeling like the, the like, I, think, I guess it's algae or something, like all the slime and gunk, it just, ugh. I hate it, and I hate touching, like, sharp rocks and just, bleh. <laughs> See, that reminds me, one time I was in Florida visiting family when I was like, oh gosh, I might have been like 11, if that. Um, and uh, we went to a, a number of beaches while we were there, but there was this one beach where the water was like a brown red. And like my grandparents were like, oh, you know, it's fine, it's clean. And like, I'm sure it was. But you legitimately could not see your feet, and that freaked me out so bad I did not want to go in the water, and I didn't. <laughs> I paddled around for like a minute, I realized that I couldn't see the bottom, and I just, I noped right out of there. And I played in the sand for the rest of the day. Oh, I did not like that. Also, we're keeping our glasses on because we're blind and we can't see without them. Come on, I just, would something bubble already? <laughs> I just want to catch stuff. Is that a fish? I think I was just seeing stuff. Oh gosh, no, don't leave the water. <laughs> Boy, Captain. I like how he watches. Oh, whoa. Gosh darn it. No. <laughs> I like how he watches you as you swim by. I wonder if we can see Pascal today. Because we haven't seen him in like a good few months. <laughs> and I kind of really like that character. I think he's awesome. And I wish he had a bit more of a presence, but he doesn't, unfortunately. Is it really his first game? I, I know that he wasn't in the original, and I know that he wasn't in Wild World, but I don't know about, like, you know, villagers that were brought over from city folk. Because, like, fun fact, I did not realize that Kix, uh... Is that his name? I don't even know his name. Uh, I didn't realize that he was brought over from city folk until, like after maybe a year of playing this game and then seeing him in the, I guess, city part of City Folk, <laughs> shining your shoes. I didn't realize that. It was so different. But yeah, it's only because I didn't play City Folk when it came out. Oh, oh, don't disappear, don't disappear. Oh gosh, jellyfish coming my way. Oh gosh, sea slug. These are all things we've already caught before. I'm very surprised my character hasn't gotten a tan yet. But I guess in general I don't play that often. Oh gosh. Head first right into a jellyfish. That must have hurt. But it's better than it going after my booty like it usually does. Oh gosh. And if you guys have watched... Uh, I think it was... I was doing like a, a diving stream or something. You guys know exactly what I'm referring to. <laughs> sea grapes, already caught that. Caught that, if you could say caught that. I think it just kind of sits there. <laughs> I think that's one of the shadows that doesn't really move, I think. Oh, I hear bubbles. I hear, oh, you're moving. What are you? Are you like an octopus or something? Is it an octopus that you can catch this way or is it a squid? I think it's an octopus, right? Yeah, I knew what it was. I already have that. Ah, it's new. Yay. But seriously, all right, this episode is going to be called Do I Already Have That? Just confirmed, you guys, right now. You guys 
actually have already seen that considering you clicked on the thumbnail to get into this video, but as of filming it, I have not even made the thumbnail, so wrap your little minds around that. <laughs> oh, hi! You're not moving, what are you? Another pearl oyster, nothing I really wanted. Ooh, actually, did we get any more of these? Ooh, we did! It bred some extra ones, that's awesome. We're gonna put those around Peggy's house for sure. Is this another one of the same? Are we just gonna get a lot of these today or? Yeah, apparently we're gonna get a lot of pearl oysters. Also, that is a really fat fish. Is that just the sea bass? just looks super fat from that angle, I guess. Oh gosh, excuse me. Is this more bubbles? Bubbles? Ooh, you're quite large. But you're also not moving. Oh, uh, we already have one of those. Oh gosh, <laughs> scared away a rather large fish. Oh, there's another one. Sorry, coming through. Just scare all the fish away, you guys. Oh, I see more bubbles. I feel like this is just another one. No, sea grapes, all right, not bad. At least it's not another pearl oyster. <laughs> oh gosh, nope, nope. <sighs> Did you guys see? That swerved, though. <laughs> don't, don't, don't. Oh, I hate that. I hate that so much. This is why I don't like diving. Man. <laughs> Salty crystal. Oh, and then you hear it bubble as you swim away, and you're like, gosh darn it. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go donate this, because I just... Oh, diving, man. I don't, I don't like it. I do not like this. Oops, excuse me. I should probably maybe take this over to Rosewood. Rosewood, sorry. <laughs> um, and let other crystal have them because other crystal is running low on pink roses. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> Did I leave these here or? I'm gonna go put this away. There we go, perfect. I also got the white rose that everyone was freaking out about in the comment section from the last episode. I don't know how many comments I received <laughs> about that one singular white rose. Ooh, actually, no, wait. I don't have my fishing rod, never mind. I was gonna say we should go try and catch the crawfish now that it's probably been reset, but we don't have any tools on us. I'm sorry to wake you up again, buddy. I know I usually only do this like once a day, but uh, to make a donation. That octopus. Perfect, alright, now that's it, buddy. Alrighty, so I think we're gonna have to end this episode here, guys. When we return, it will be Tuesday? Yeah, I think Tuesday is when I usually film. Uh, but I will be streaming tonight again, 7 p.m. EST. Also, look out for the town tour video for my other town, especially if you haven't actually seen Rosewood yet. I know I talk a lot about it, so it must be kind of weird for you guys who haven't actually, actually, like, you know, had the chance to see it, whether on stream or through videos. But, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Blathers, your neck is kind of creeping me out right now, dude. You're... I wish he would do the owl thing. He'd turn his head all the way around, but I don't think Nintendo would allow that, considering it's kind of creepy. Um, at least for Animal Crossing. <laughs> but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will 
see you guys next time